Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Meme, also known as Memsnight. On my space here, I make natural hair videos, parent teacher tip videos, and lifestyle talking videos. If you're interested in any of this, click the subscribe button to join the family. So, before I start this video, I just want to give a shout out to Ade Soil for my t shirt. Thanks, Ade Soil. Love it rocking it if you don't know who Ade Soil is please check them out on Instagram Ade Soil is amazing she's my friend so I'm definitely a supporter of Ade Soil go get your own tea in today's video I'm going to be telling you two secrets to a successful natural hair journey what does that even mean if you want your natural hair journey to be successful you need to know and live by these two tips this journey has been all about confidence like on my space on my channel in my life i constantly 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 talk about confidence with natural hair and the main reason i do that is because when we were growing up natural hair was not popping it was not something that anybody did when i was in nigeria as a teenager if your hair was natural it was either because you were part of a very strict religious community aka deeper life or you didn't have money you were poor couldn't afford relaxer had strict parents who just insisted that you wear your hair like a house girl when we were growing up we were told natural hair looked unkempt we were told natural hair looked untidy we were told natural hair was gross all that was what was synonymous with natural hair when i was in secondary school natural hair was not pretty at all so now everybody going team natural natural all the way natural to the grave it's all nice and good but let's be real it takes a while for something that you grew up thinking was wrong to all of a sudden become right so my idea of a successful natural hair journey is confidence with your natural hair acceptance of your natural hair healthy natural hair and styling natural hair if you've got all these four things down tick 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 then you're on your way to living a successful natural hair journey number one the first first thing is to create routine plan routine what other synonyms can i use regimen you know if you plan your day you plan your week you plan your meals you have to plan for your natural hair as well planning your natural hair just basically means creating a regimen creating a routine making sure that you set aside time for the care of your natural hair so your wash day you should have a set time for your wash day and you should have a set routine if you're going to do treatments you should make sure that you have a set time for the treatments if you know that your treatment is going to take three hours don't do your treatment on a day that you are super busy do it on a day that you have set aside rescheduled all your plans and that day is free for you for at least the hours that you need to do your hair so you can really focus on it if you don't plan for it fail to plan you plan to fail but you have to have a plan you have to have a plan for when you're going to wash your hair how often you're going to wash your hair you have to have a plan for your protective styles what protective styles are you going to wear speaking about styles number two so the second tip is styling when you get style and you know what style suits you it helps to build confidence with your hair and you have one less thing to worry about so i'm going to tell you what i learned about different shapes of faces so that you could probably try it out yourself that's how i was able to find what suits me today there are so many face shapes like i've even seen triangle but back when i was younger there was just four main shapes there was the round there was the oval there was the long and there was the square and we knew that if you had any of these shapes like you had to learn what kind of hairstyles suited your face I always kept that in mind when um, styling my hair choose a style that works for you with your shape of face choose a style that you can constantly go back to because that would help to boost your confidence and at the end of the day that's what we're about on this space it's confidence for the natural hair for me it is routine and hairstyle 
and that's what keeps me going that's what keeps me confident that's what i feel are the two main important things on a natural hair journey until next time don't forget to spread love spread positivity and live to inspire i will see you bye